Let me just press the so this is how long? This this uh, this is last Monday, right? Yeah, last Monday. Was that a, a, a big hole? Did she dig it's a big hole? It's quite deep, around just around the size of my the the length of my index finger. So last Monday, that means uh, how many days ago? Uh, for the first time she dig, uh, right? Yeah, for the first time. At Ten years of age. So the best is uh, you get a, a big box of soil uh, inside your house, uh, so so you can dig overnight and the eggs are this one way. Uh, the other way, of course. Today is what day? It may two. Mm. Okay, what happened to this? She's not laying eggs. Yeah, thirteen. How old is she? Ten, eleven years old. They're quite small, you know. For the ten, eleven olds, years old. Then the other one? Eh? The other one is a male. The, nothing wrong, ah. Eh? Nothing wrong. Just a regular check. Oh, okay. So we, we just talk about the female first, huh? okay. How do you know he's laying eggs, ah? Eh? Because she was uh, like digging. Where digging? Where? Uh, like she was using her back legs trying to dig the floor. Uh, uh, when, when was that? It was oh. around one week ago. So I brought her down to the garden there. Correct. And she she started digging the soil, but then she dug she dug for around two hours plus, mm -hmm. but nothing. She just continued digging. So. How would that be time? Uh, for the past four days is like not very good. So don't have her. Uh, no appetite. No appetite. But this morning she ate quite a lot. Yesterday the whole day she didn't eat anything. How do you house her in an aquarium or in a in a oh, tank? Yeah, a big tank. With water? Yeah, with water. Sometimes they do lay eggs in the water, you know. No, but she doesn't. She ever lay eggs before? No, it's my first time seeing her. At this, uh, what age now? Is it this now? Ten years old. Are you sure or not? Ten years is quite small, you know. You got it from a small one, right? Yeah, yeah. But it's pyramiding, uh, that means. You, you feed a lot of protein, is it? What do you feed? Pellets. Pellets only? Yeah, the pellets only. When she's not eating, I try to feed her carrots to see whether she eats or not. No meat? Nah. No meat. But this looks like, uh, I mean the length of the shell. Uh, it looks like 10, that's why. Just now you see how old? The 11. 10, 10 to 11. 11. Possible, it's possible. So it doesn't grow much. Was there any sunlight? Yeah, because we put them next to the window where they get the morning sun. Mm. Yeah, and 30 grams is, is not uh, not very heavy. So we are doing x-ray for some okay. in this case. This is a 10 year old. Uh, Three years later, digging the soil and the and the hind legs last week. So the owner thought that uh, she's about to lay eggs, which is true, as you can see. There are three eggs only, luckily. So I have 15. Now this is the one where the x-ray was taken today. See, she lost appetite. So I will give oxytocin injection two times today and tomorrow. Owner was supposed to find the box with the soy, a big box with soy, quite deep enough for her to lay eggs. Some of them do lay eggs in the water. Uh, in Singapore, apartments is difficult to have gardens and uh, so you need a box in a dark place and we'll see whether they lay eggs or not. So this is the x-ray and uh, this is a very beautiful x-ray actually you can see three eggs two big ones and one small one, ten year old female. So you have a basking light or something? Or, yeah, yeah. or warm light? You still have? Yeah. What light is it? Is it ultraviolet? No, I, I, I don't have a basking light. It's just the post is next to the window, so there's the morning sun. Oh. Okay, so, so it does have light now.
Did they have direct sunlight? Yeah, direct sunlight. For how long? Uh, usually I just, because since they are there, so there's a bit of shade as well. So usually when I think they are they will go done, hide they, yeah, oh. they will hide. Yeah, they got drying, uh, they got dry, drying. Uh, so, the, so there's no shell rot, right? Have you got shell rot in, in the past? Don't have, right? Uh, Those white spots? No, no. Don't have. Uh. So pellets 20 per day. So about a bit overfed. Uh. So I should cut down this. Normally, they, they, when they're old, uh, normally every day. Uh. I mean, they can be alternate days. Uh. Or cut. Today is May 22017. This morning, the younger brought a 10 year old female terrapin for examination because she suspect that she had difficulty in laying eggs. She was scratching the soil and paddling in a, with her hind legs. She did, she digs a hole in the soil but uh, could not lay eggs for the past seven days. Then it rained so she didn't leave the been out in the soil after two hours and there was no eggs so she came today so I suggested x-ray x-ray showed definitely there were three eggs inside you can see in the video and uh, so since she came rather early as compared to other owners who, who might come rather late after about maybe three or four weeks of uh, egg binding, she came early and uh, so about uh, three hours ago we gave oxytocin IM and as you can see this therapy is about 860 kg, uh, 60, 860 grams and given oxytocin Two international units, I am uh, three eggs were laid. Okay, now you have the eggs. This is the as shown in the X-rays. This would be one of them. This one of them. The, the bigger one. The second one, and then this will be this one. The smaller one, and then the broken ones. The broken pieces should be the third one. Either that or the broken pieces could be the shell. The shell of the two eggs laid. So we don't really uh, say that uh, three eggs are laid, but definitely two eggs are laid. And uh, the other one looks like shells, uh, egg shells, I would say. Uh, so the only way to confirm is by x-ray but uh, we'll wait and see till, till tomorrow. Now this is uh, a case where the owner didn't delay too long. Case of egg binding which has been uh, treated by oxytocin and which results in successful laying of at least two eggs as you can see here. I put it here in the water so there was really no need to to uh, buy sand or soil for her to lay eggs but uh, is there another one that's a question let me check here this looks like shells uh, broken shells yeah. shells now these shells could have come from uh, as you can see could be come from one of the bigger eggs. Uh. See, it seems to fit this one. And uh, this this terrapin is stays by herself, so there's no chance of the male fertilizing the eggs. And uh, so I would suspect that uh, we wait till tomorrow. See whether there be another egg late. There might be a, another one medium size between the big one and the small one.
normally two two injection of oxytocin are given and uh, this must be done early for example about seven days on showing signs of egg binding that means difficulty in passing eggs and not wait till three weeks four weeks later and uh, usually two injections are recommended for bio vets egg binding in red year sliders 10 year old female Singapore May 2, 2017 a successful response from injection of oxytocin to induce egg laying and uh, definitely two eggs were laid now from what I see there are only two eggs laid but uh, the other ones are actually shells uh, egg shells so these eggs are quite solid, like, like stones like that. Not like chicken eggs where you can find that uh, the, the, when the eggshell is broken. Uh, this one is quite soft. You can actually pr uh, crack this one. Uh. Quite short, soft. And there seems to be some egg white inside this shell. So maybe three eggs have been laid. It's hard to say unless we x-ray to vets May 22017